contest between two old friends of ours here on Eurosport. The bald-headed man in the far corner. He could be an old friend or he could be an old enemy. The grim rocker from France. I would say he's more of an enemy than a friend. his opponent here he is from Zaire a great favorite here in Eurosport the black legend from Zaire Prince Sefi Sefi stalking around the ring like a black panther which is indeed what he is Taken this fight on against doctor's orders as you can see on his right shoulder is a huge strapping being the result of an injury when he fought Ulf the Krull here on Eurosport at Blue Hour recently oh comes the Grim Rocker with the tackles. Oh, and a tremendous move there by Zeffi. This is still a good wrestler. Beautifully built. Beautiful balance by this young man from Zaire. And a good, perfectly timed drop kick by Zeffi. Zeffi looking for a suplex. Yes, he gets it. Goes to the for the pin, but too soon, too soon. Ooh, and Sefi pulls him in, and the rocker thought he was being posted, as I did, but it was a clothesline. Power slam by the Negro. Good hit toss there from the Grim Rocker. Both these men, experienced wrestlers, both have been wrestling for over 10 years. Good block by Zephy and a good hip toss. Down he goes. One, two, no. Let's see this once again, under he comes, and switches it, a good hip toss. He's a clever wrestler, and out goes the Grim Rocker. A short monkey climb, and out goes the Rocker. will be a tough opponent for any man. Street fighter from Paris. Zephy's got the street fighter if in the air, trying to get him over. Oh, and a tremendous suplex. One, no, off on the count of two. Referee Charlie Boulay. Good head scissors. By a drop kick, Sefi's well on top. The crowd here in France really love this young boy from Zaire. Another good suplex, but not enough. the climb and he gets it goes for another one but this time Rocket knew what was happening it often surprises me let's have a look at it again here we go a good monkey climb 
as I was saying, it surprises me very, very often how a wrestler, after doing one good move, he goes for it again. And naturally, his opponent knows what's coming. This is why it's imperative for you to know if you're in the wrestling ring as many moves as possible so you have a variation of tactics. Crowd here in Colombia showing everything that is about wrestling on their faces. It's all there. The mystery is there, the power is there, the speed is there, the admiration is all there on this knowledgeable crowd's face. And Zephy being throttled by this bald headed tough fighter from Paris. <laughs> Good elbow from Zephy. Half a punch and half a slap was the reply of the Grim Rocker. Zephy takes a good posting there with the pad being away. Obviously taken down behind the referee's back by the rocker, and he's now taking the other pad down. Zephy catches it again, he goes into the other unpadded corner. This can't be doing the young man from Zaire any good at all. Oh, but this time, the Grim Rocker runs at him, tries to drop him in the corner, but Zephy saw him coming. Upstairs goes Zephy. He's been headbutted. This time, I would say Zephy is going for a power slam. He's got his man well positioned. Yes, he is. Slams him down, but doesn't follow him. He decides to go upstairs. He's gone right upstairs. Let's see him. What happens from the corner post? He's given his opponent too much time. But oh. Great, a really great drop kick there, and he covers his man. One, two, three, and Jeffrey Charlie Bullet counts. And the winner is Prince Zephy from Zaire. Well, to me, he took an awful long time to come down off that corner post. And despite having an injured shoulder, the winner, a very popular one at that. From Zaire. Eurosport. Eurosport News. Up to the minute daily news.
news report on all sporting activity as it happens. Monday to Friday, it's your opportunity to...